Sarah Cox, home of Brilliant Children's Books. Meow! Hi everyone, I'm, I'm Sarah Dory, and um, I'm up in a tree. Can you believe it? I just thought we should get really better footage up here. So it's, it's really high, but this took a lot of doing to get up here, so like... So yeah, um, today I'll be reviewing um, Monstrous Mod. This is going to be like the last uh, Monstrous Mod I'm going to be doing. And it's called um, The School Scare. Or is it the, yeah, The School Scare. So I am pretty, this is pretty scary up here. <laughs> like, so I'm, this is the right book to do since I'm up here. Cause it's... So yeah, uh, The School Scare. So I'm going to read the blurb. A nasty wizard is trying to close Maud's beloved new school, Rotwood. Maud will have to act monstrously fast to stop him. Yeah, so, um, uh, I had to read this book twice because I'm not sure if I was, like, concentrating quite well on the, um, book, so I read it twice. So, um, yeah. So I read it twice and I understand it more so yeah so like kind of same people and uh, yeah so the school scare so um, the school scare is like with as I said on the blurb monstrous Maud is trying to save her school from getting shut down like would you try and stop your school from getting shut down I'm not sure would you if you like school you might <laughs> if you don't, I don't think you're gonna try. But Maud really loves her school because she didn't fit in in any other school, like I said in the first book. So yeah, um, so there's the same characters in this. I think it was a bit more exciting than maybe all the others because it's, well, a mystery kind of. And uh, yeah, uh, so she s tries to save her school and um, do you think she could do it? Do you think she could save her own school? Well, you have to find out in the book. So, this is by A.B. A. Saddlewick. Um, so if you want to look that name up, uh, it will, Monstrous Maud will probably come up, like I said in lots of other videos. So yeah, um, so, so Quentin's in this as well. I've Quentin's like in all the books, like I've mentioned him a lot. So yeah, as I said, he's a very scared mouse. And um, Maud and Maud's friends get invited to um, Penelope's party. And uh, so if I've, I have said her name wrong before, but this time I'm gonna say it right. So it's Penelope, not Penelope. <laughs> so yeah. Um, so her friends get invited to Pen Penelope's party, so yeah, and you, there might be, I don't know, destru destruction in her party or something, but um, I'm not sure if I mentioned, um, well, I'm not sure if I should mention this, so I'm probably not going to spoil anything, because I really, I, I'm terrible, I don't want to spill the beans again. <laughs> so yeah, um, it's a bit uncomfortable up here, but yeah, so um, she's got her same friends, and yeah, as I, I think I've mentioned in the last book about um, Penelope's friend, I think her, I think um, she is her friend, Invisible Isabel, so yeah, I hope you did enjoy that part where I put an invisible person <laughs> at the back, so yeah, um, I really do hope you enjoy this book. Now, star ratings. I'd probably give this book four um, stars because I'm not sure if it was like that good as the other books, but um, you might enjoy it more than I did because I had to read it twice, like I said. So, yeah. Um, so, yeah, I do hope you understand it more than I understood it first time. So, I'm sure you get through it the first time because I wasn't exactly. I wasn't exactly concentrating that well so yeah um, 
So I've done all the books now. So um, I do hope you um, enjoyed them all. And don't forget to like and subscribe and click the bell. And you'll never miss another episode. So I really hope you um, enjoyed all the series of the books. Um, and I wish you, you uh, good luck with them. And hope you enjoy reading all these books. Because I certainly did. So it was a pretty good adventure. So yeah. Um, thank you for listening. Bye-bye.